In the 1960s, scientists actually tried to make humans breathe underwater. In a dimly lit lab, a researcher carefully lowers a small mouse into a glass tank filled with a clear, strange liquid. That liquid was called perfluorocarbon, a substance that can hold massive amounts of oxygen. The goal? To let lungs absorb air through liquid. The mouse sinks motionless for a few seconds. Then, incredibly, it starts breathing again underwater. Scientists were shocked. The experiment worked. Years later, they tried it on the larger animals and eventually on a human volunteer. In 1989, a Japanese researcher reportedly breathed liquid for several seconds. He survived, but described it as drowning while staying alive. The project was stopped soon after. The pain and danger were simply too much, but the idea never truly died. Even today, NASA studies liquid breathing for deep sea missions and perhaps space. If humans could truly breathe underwater, would we still fear drowning?